Hey internet, so today I'm going to show you how to unlock the Invoke Lord of Bones incantation. So you need the codex. If you're an Iron Man, you need to do the quest Battle for Ferenthi, and then you need to beat the boss Zemmerigal and Vorkath. So that is a PVM boss that you need to beat until he drops the codex. For main characters, you can just buy this on Grand Exchange. At the time of recording, I bought mine for 370 million. Currently it is 214 million, but it is rising for some reason. I don't know why. However, once you have the codex, simply read it and you'll unlock this one over here. So w without further ado, and you will need the runes to cast the incantation. So first let me read it. Do I want to unlock this ability? Yes, it is a consumable. So once you unlock it, your codex disappears. All right. So now it's unlocked, as you can see on the right hand side, there's a pop-up message. So what does it do? If you can read on the screen, well I'll just tell you. Basically the skeletons apply shattering bones to the target for one minute. Now that reduces the armor rating for every stack and it stacks 200 times maximum. So what does that mean? Well, it means that you just deal more damage because they have lower armor or no armor or negative armor if you can get it that low. So that is why it is, uh, I, well, I would say it's a pretty good uh, incantation. And the cost is worth it. I mean, you use it once and then you use it, then you, well, you learn it once and then you use it forever. So I think it's not too bad. The runes that you need to cast is 8 spirit runes, I believe it is 1 miasma, 2 flesh runes, and let me just check my rune pouch, it's easy that way. Um, so let me just check, retrieve them, okay. So you need eight spirit runes. You need six bone runes and two flesh runes and one miasma rune. So you can buy these on Grand Exchange. Once again, if you're an Iron Man, you would need to craft these yourself and you would need the crafting levels. So I believe you don't need too high of a level. I think somewhere around about the 80s, I believe. I could be wrong on that one. Um, yeah, it's about 60. Okay. So not even 80. So 60 rune crafting, the minimum is what you need to craft all the runes. So it's not that bad. All right. So it's helpful for PVM mostly, but you could also use for it in Slayer, so high level Slayer monsters. I wouldn't necessarily use it on low level ones because that's just wasting runes. So monsters that you can one shot, there's no point in doing it. But monsters that have high HP and high resistance, then you would probably use it on those. And of course, works on all bosses so well most bosses I can't say all bosses they might release a boss in the future with which makes them immune to certain incantations but there will be a future problem and we'll cover that in a future episode all right thanks for watching hope you had a great day be sure to like subscribe share with your friends ring the bell turn on all notifications leave a comment below if this was helpful do you use Invoke Lord of Bones for your inc inc incantation? I can't speak today. And we do it in one take. Alright. 
Until next time, see ya.